doing a very poor job. Actually, who played this game? Oh my gosh, this is uh this is a game between Benjamin Bach and Orange Ghost. This is a game this is a game uh the ben good old Benji played. Okay, let's go to the next game that we have. This is a game between adoptee and adopter. Um so d4 not knight f6 is played. C4 E6, knight c3, bishop b4. Okay, standard e3, bishop d2. Wow, this is very um this is like very classic chess. This is uh this is surprisingly classical. This looks like a very high level. Wow, knight h5. If I didn't know better, I honestly want to think this might be one of my games. Okay, rook b8, d5 takes. This looks like very high quality game. Wow. This is a very high quality game. Wow. Um, I mean, it's a short game, but the quality is extremely high level. There's some mistakes, but I, I don't know. I think this is high. The opening is very good too. Like knowing knight h5 is very unusual. This is a very high level move um, to play. Very high level move. Yeah, I think we'll open we'll open up submissions already. Yeah, if they aren't already open, we'll open them now. I mean, knight h I mean this game is like rook b rook b it's maybe not best, but it's also not a bad move. It shows good understanding. Queen f6 is pretty good. This has to be pretty high. I just don't know if it's like 2600 high or it's like 2400 high. Or if it's like 2000 high. I don't know. Very tricky. I mean, this could be this could honestly be one of my games. I wouldn't be shocked if this is one of my games, but I don't I don't think it is. Okay, yeah, so we'll we'll we'll, we'll close it at um we'll close it at four uh, we'll close it at fifteen or fourteen. We'll we'll give you guys another minute or so. I I, I have a pretty good idea of what I want to guess. Knight h5 is just such a high class move. Very high class. And bishop d2 is already very unusual too. Like this the setup with e3 bishop d2, a lot of GMs play it. So I think it, I, I I have a pretty good idea of what I'm gonna guess. Yeah, I think I think I think I have a pretty good I idea. Look at the end game carefully. I mean, it was very well played. I mean, White missed a win somewhere in here. Maybe Queen G4 first was the win, I guess. But very high level, very 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 high level. All right, I am gonna go with um. What am I gonna go with on this one? I'm gonna go with like. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to go for it here. I'm going to go for the gamble. I'm going to go with, uh, I'm going to go for 20, 2800. I'm going to go 2800. I'm either really, I'm like either really right or really wrong. It's either going to be like 20, 2900 or it's going to be like 2400. I don't know which one, but I'm going to go with 2800. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. I, I could be right. It could be wrong. It's going to be, it's either going to be like 2900 or it's going to be 2400. It's, there's no in between here on this one. Yes, I'm right. I'm right. Yes, very good. I, I was almost exactly right. The average is 2892. Very, very bad chat. That's very bad. See, like sometimes you're right, but generally I'm closer on average. So you guys are doing a very poor job. Actually, who played this game? Oh my gosh, this is uh, this is a game between Benjamin Bach and Orange Ghost. This is a game. This is a game. Uh, the ben, good old Benji played. So that's why it's 2892 average rating. Yeah. Yeah. I had a feeling. I, I had a feeling. Um, I had I had a feeling that this had to be a uh that this had to be pretty high level, just based on based on the move. So that's good. All right, so we're e all even. It's three three with four to go, you guys. Let's go on to the next one. Hold this up. Okay. All right, let's pull up the next game. Give me one second. Okay, here we go. Next game. All right, let's go to this game. This is a game between Abamanu Mishra and Jan Nepomniach. So e4. c6 is played. Knight f3, d6. Okay, so already surprising. Jan chooses not to play the Karo Khan. Uh, knight c3 played here. h6, d4, g5. Okay, so very unusual kind of opening here. Uh, d5 is played. Bishop g7. Bishop to e3. Bishop g4. Bishop d4, okay. E5? Very weird. Okay, white knows end peasant, which already shows a very high level. 
the fact that white knows end peasant um tells you that they have to be at least probably about 1500 here trades f6 Oof. she takes e6 okay h4 it says nepo yeah these are fake names you guys um these are fake names of course this is not actually Jan's game the g4 knight h2 king e7 okay this is just weird what wait what is knight g4 very weird game okay so white finds a checkmate um so Misha wins this game against Nepo uh what what is my actual guess gonna be all right you guys I'll we'll, we'll open it up for you guys to start guessing very short game very weird opening um white found a checkmate has some interesting tactics I've got to go low on this I think we'll we'll close it at eight, at uh we'll close it at 19. two minutes you guys you have two minutes to get your guesses in oh this is pretty difficult I don't even know on this one hmm the opening is really weird white new and peasant so it's got to be at least a thousand I would I would say at least um because normally when you're in the, in the heat of the battle you're you're not gonna remember those things so it's got to be at least like at least 1000 so how much above it can it be I would gander a guess to say that it's not much much more King e7 is a very strange move too because King e7 is either pure brilliance or stupidity um I think it's probably uh oof I really don't have a good guess on this I really don't have a good guess oh man I think my instincts my instinct leads me to think it's probably I really don't have a good guess on this one this is really difficult um what could this be hmm gotta be over 1000 I'm gonna go with uh we we're gonna close in one minute. I'm gonna go with uh I'm gonna go with um I'm gonna go with my lucky number I think on this one I'm gonna go with my lucky number I'm gonna go with uh I'm gonna go with 11 11. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with all ones I'm gonna go with 11 11 on this one that's what I'm gonna go with you can only guess once you guys all right 11 11 is my guess go with my lucky number I think I'm wrong but I I I, I don't know let's see a lot of people saying like 11 12. It, there's no way this above it yeah we, we yeah chat wins I I'm I'm kind of not surprised 1389 yeah I, I actually thought it might be higher that's not surprising uh but 1389 very hard to judge I guess probably I should have guessed higher because when, when I look at the game there are some there are some good themes shown but yeah it's it's uh that's not too surprising all right um Okay, what is the next game that we have? Okay, we have our next game. Okay, let's see. So here's our next game. All right. In a second, let me load it up. Will be number eight. Chat is ahead three two, I think, right or four four three rather right now. So okay, this is the next game. This is between Lewis Hamilton and Max Verstappen. D four D five, C four C six. Okay. Knight f3, knight f6, knight c3, a6. Okay. This is already very surprising. This is a Chebanenko Slav or the Chameleon variation. That's another they call it the Chebanenko or the Chameleon. Because black basically doesn't show his spots. He might play b5. He might also take and play c5. So it's very chameleon-like because there are a lot of different ideas with your pawns on the queen side here. Um okay, so a6 is played. Uh e3, b5, b3. Bishop g4 a4 b4 now this is uh something that I used to play when I was much younger uh this this, this Chabonenko with like e6 and knight d7 I had a lot of games in fact I might have had an over the board game with this against Robert Kempinski from uh from P Poland uh with something very similar to this I don't think it was exactly this position but there was some game that I had where Kempinski played like a played like a Bishop d2 and an a4 move I'll, I'll look that up later um but anyway a4 b4 played 92 a5 95 trade e6 played here by max verstappen castles bishop d6 f4 okay so white tries to play a stone wall here you do give up the square on e4 at the same time it shouldn't be that big of a deal 
The castle is played, so bishop b2. Queen c7, rook c1, queen b7, bishop d3. All pretty normal. Knight d7, queen f3, good move. Rook c8, c5, bishop b7, g4. b6, h4. h5 takes. Queen g2. Takes. King h7. Queen g4. Knight g7, h5. Looks very, very good for white. Like, actually, very, very good. h5, knight f5, king f2. King g7, rook h1, rook h8, rook g1. Rook h6, takes, rook g6. Verstappen tries to hold. Takes, oh man, you can't take the queen because after rook takes, king f8. Hamilton has a checkmate with rook h8 here. Oh man, this is, so takes, e6. Oh my gosh, e6, brutal. Oof. Oh my god, that's so brutal. Man, Verstappen got destroyed in this game. Ouch, because you take the queen, I have rook eight. Oh man, that's brutal. Absolutely brutal game. Um, this is a high level game. I just don't know how high level. Like this could this could be like a 2800 game very easily. Um, this could be very high level. I don't know. Anyway, okay, you guys. Uh, we'll we'll leave this open to like for another two minutes. Um, I think this is high level. I really do. So we'll close it at 24. My instinct is that this this has to be at least 2500 based on the opening. Opening shows good understanding by both sides generally like by both sides so this has to be at least 2500 the only question to me is whether it's like 26 27 or it's like 29 3000 ish this could be this could actually be a game that i played this, this looks like a game that i could have played um i mean i i don't know if i go for glory or not i'm gonna go for i'm gonna i think i'm gonna go for glory here i think i'm gonna go for glory i think i'm gonna say it's like uh i'm gonna assume that who plays who who's on who's on who's on chess.com who plays the uh who plays the Chabonenko is what I'm trying to think. Who plays the Chabonenko? Minlay plays doesn't play this slob. He plays a different slob. Um, who else plays slobs? Who else plays slobs? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go high. I'm I'm just gonna go high here. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh. Oh, by the way, apparently Ludwig is in chat as well. So big shout out to Ludwig. Congra thanks thanks for playing, man. If you want to do this sometime, we should definitely. We should definitely uh, do some guessing because I would assume you have a better understanding. All right. Um, okay. My guess, my guess is that I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go very high on this one. I'm gonna go very high. I think I'm gonna go twenty. I'm gonna go twenty-eight forty-five. I'm gonna go twenty-eight forty-five. So let's let's see. That, that's gonna be my guess. I think it's a high-level game. I, I could be wrong. I, this is another one where it's either going to be really high, like 2,800, or it's going to be like a 2,500. It, it's the exact same as the previous one. I don't know what the answer is. Let's see. Let's see what we get. It's either 25 or it's like 29. Okay, chat says 2,707. Yes, chat loses. Yes, chat loses. Good. I think they lose, right? Yeah, I said 2,845. Chat loses. Good good um all right so <laughs> four four yeah four four 2701 actually do we know whose game this was oh let me see um because this feels like a uh this feels like one of these uh oh this was a Hans game Hans Neiman played this game okay Hans against who this is Hans Neiman against uh This was Hans versus who, though? Hans versus Alex Rustamov. Okay, so Hans Neiman versus Alex Rustamov is a game. Okay, so, um, so so yeah, so so twenty that makes makes some sense. All right. Um, okay, so let's let's keep going. All right, let's pull up our next game. Give me one second. So it's it's all even four four, four four is what it is. Okay, okay, our next game. Let's go back. This is a game between. Meek Mills and Drake, the famous rapper. Okay, e4 is played, e5. Pretty standard, knight f3, knight c6. Okay, bishop, not bishop b5. d4 is played by Meek Mills in honor of, of Felix Longgel. Takes, takes, bishop c5. He plays bishop e3, queen f6, c3. Um, good understanding, pretty, pretty normal, knight e7. Bishop c4, knight takes c4 again. 
Not the best move here. Normally, black plays uh, black and play 95 d6 or castles. I had some very old games where I had like 95 bishop e2 and then castles, castles, queen g6 was one line. You can also go queen g6 here right away, and there's like a castles or a bishop h5 line. Very, very complicated. Um, anyway, black takes. So this shows a bit of a lack of understanding. Black's not supposed to trade like this, so not perfect understanding of theory. So they queen g6, castles, castles, f4, good move. Knight c6, queen e3, d6, f5. Okay, queen f6, g4, knight e5, bishop e2. Okay, so there's some some understanding. Queen h4, g5, knight g4, d8, knight d2, bishop d7. Bishop f5 here, I think, is actually winning, by the way. If takes, there's rook e3 and blocks up a queen. Maybe take with the rook. I take your rook. You take, takes, and I have two rooks um, for your knight and your rook. This actually would be um, would be a little bit little bit dubious. Okay, so bishop d7, rook g1, queen h4. Again, missing queen takes f5 here. Again, very, very good. Knight f3 takes. Ooh, ooh, big blunder here by uh, by Meek Mills. Knight f3 takes, f6 takes. Whoa, what is takes? Actually, here, if black was bishop c6 and lines up the lines up the diagonal, this is just GG's. This is kind of insane. Knight g5, and now black's lost. Drake blunders this away. What is Drake doing here? Bishop e6 takes. Now white just up a up a rook. Rook g4. Uh what is knight g5 here? Okay. Okay. Um very bad blunders at the end, but the players probably were a little bit low on time. So so Drake wins this game when all is said and done. Uh, what do, what do I think about this game though? I really have not, I don't have a good idea at all. I mean, this wasn't, this was kind of weird. Um, what do I think this is? This is really hard. Tactics are missed, but there's some, the general understanding is decent. I mean, you guys think 900 max? I don't believe, I don't believe for a second. This is not an XQC game. No, there, there are too few blunders. Like Bishop E2. I mean, there's just there, there's just too few blunders. Yeah, so we'll we'll keep this one open till 30. So two two minutes, you guys. Um My instinct. I mean, there there's some there are blunders that are missed. I think 1700 would have seen Bishop F5. I think so, I think it's lower than 1700. But how low can this really be? Because I mean, the, the blunders at the end are probably time. Like, right here, this is probably just... I don't know, though. Knight g5 is such a big blunder. It hinges on this move. This is what it all hinges on. Like, if, it, if they're low on time, I think I'm right with what I'm, I'm thinking initially. If they weren't low on time, and this is just a blunder, then probably it's way below. So it's either, like, right where I think it is, or it's way below based on this one move. And whether this move was just a blunder, or white had no time. My instinct is that probably white had no time here, so I'm gonna go high. I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with 15:22. That's what I'm gonna go. With. I'm gonna go with 15:22. I I don't know if it's right or not, but it's what I'm gonna go with. Very difficult. I'm crazy. Maybe I am crazy. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. What's the answer? Yeah, chat got it right. It's 12, 1242. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I went too high. Although I think I don't think I would have gone low. And I mean, chat got it so close anyway. I wouldn't have I wouldn't have been closer. So I would not have guessed that it was lower than 1300. There's no way I would have guessed lower, below 13. So uh, chat would have been right no matter what. All right. Uh, it was my game. Can you see? Can you see names? Triva says it's my game. Was it? I don't know. I, uh, I have to ask the mods. Was it? Okay, so we have one more game. Okay, so it's actually isn't every single game going the other way? It's like literally, uh, it's literally, um, it's like, well, I got the first one, then it was two, and then every every other time it's alternated. So okay, one more to go. Let's, uh, let's load this last one. Okay, um, here we go. Okay, last game. Let me change the scene. Okay, what do we have here? This is a game between Federer and Djokovic. So e3 e5 okay normal so far queen h5 bishop c5 
takes. Okay, so Federer is doing well. Bishop e7. Queen takes g7. Bishop f6. Queen g4. d6. b3. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, that's not not exactly uh not exactly a good move. That's 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 not um not a good move okay now the problem here though is this is where like uh this is where like i don't even know how how you guess queen h5 is a beginner's line right so the question is is like basically you know what on this one i'm gonna let i'm gonna let you guys i'm gonna let you i'm gonna let chat's average come in first on this one um so chat you guys you get your average because like this one literally is like price is right this is this is literally where like either Either it's like above or below. So I'm, I'm gonna, on this one. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait to see. You want to cheat from us? No, because this one is literally just just random. I I, I want to see on this one. This is the whole game. On, on this one, I want to see. No, I'm not cheating. I'm not cheating at all. Because the thing is, on this one, I know that it's either above or below. So I'm gonna wait. Because I, I have no idea on this one. You want to debate us? Not really. Because I think I think the thing is, is it above or below? I mean, I, I, cause this literally could be 400. It could be 401. It could be like 500, 501, 600, 601. Cheating because of the wisdom of the crowd theory. How, how is that? How is that wrong? Wisdom of the crowd. Is that really, I mean, uh, like I, I also can just look at your guesses and guess higher too or lower, but I think on this one, I'm going to, I'm going to go with the assumption that it's, uh, it's probably how low can it be though? But you see, how low would you even guess? How low would you even guess? There's there is a book called Wisdom of the Crowd, highly recommended. Hmm. Yeah. It's like it's 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 like basically lower or higher. He's baiting guys to go lower. I mean, yeah, it could. I mean, I don't really know. It, it could be five hundred. It could be six hundred. It could be seven hundred. It could be eight hundred. You, you guess and let us go over under well that's the thing like it's it's literally over under and you just pray that you're right one way or the other like that's the ultimate gamble that's the ultimate gamble i'll i'll, I'll wait till I'll, I'll wait till we close it yeah what is b3 i don't i don't know what b3 is as a move um yeah because basically also you guys are you guys are either going to be it could be a mouse slip i, I don't think so Okay, let's see. What, what's the average that Chat came up with? Okay, what is the average? Did JuicerBot say what the average is? Okay, okay, let's see. The average is 693. Oh, man, that's actually a really good guess. Oh, man, 693, that's a really good guess. Oh, shoot. That's, like, really good. It could be higher, it could be lower. Um, I think I'm going to flip a coin. Do I have a coin in my office? I don't have a coin. Um, what can I flip? What can I flip? I feel like flipping a coin on this. It's not 1,000. It's like, but I don't know. I mean, 694, like, flip a, flip a chair, flip a credit card. I can't flip a credit card. Um, just flip my, flip my card for getting in. I don't have a, oh, is there, a, oh, there's a Google coin flip? Okay. Actually, you're right. There's a Google coin flip, right? Okay. Okay. Let's go to Google. Google coin flip. Okay, let's pull this up. Okay, let me change this thing very briefly. Um, okay, let's go here. Okay. Okay, so if it if it is um if it is uh if it's heads, I'm gonna guess above. If it's tails, I'm gonna guess below. So let's see. Okay, let's go. Heads, I'm heads, I'm gonna guess uh he so heads I guess above, tails I guess below, right? That's what I just said. So heads is higher, tails is lower. Okay, it's heads, so I'm guessing above. So then my I'm gonna guess 694. Let's let's see, let's uh let's 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 see what we get. One second. Um, I'm gonna guess 694 then. I'm supposed to guess higher. Let's see. Chat wins. Let's see. What does chat win or chat lose? The gall of this man. I flipped a coin. That's definitely not cheating. How do I have a big advantage? Flipping a coin. It's higher. I'm not sure it's higher than 700. So now I get to blame Google for the coin loss. Oh, 69, 694. 
694 is the guess. Let's see. Oh, chat wins. Yes, I can blame Google. Google cheated me. Google cheated me. <laughs> Google cheated me. <laughs> Google cheated me. Oh, freaking Google. Freaking Google. It's all Google's fault. I flipped the coin and Google cheated me. Very bad. Very bad. Yeah, Google cheated. Exactly. Yeah. Um... So it's 551. I guess, yeah, I mean, this last one was pretty difficult. Um, uh, like, I, I don't know what it what it could really be. Like, it, it was a it was a difficult one uh, on the final one, what, what it would be. We need an award for this. Chat owns Google. Right, Google probably knew, right? Knowing, um, knowing, knowing, uh, knowing, um, knowing that, uh, that Google probably, because it's so advanced, it was able to know that I'm streaming. It was able to know exactly what was going on. And then it cross-referenced it with the uh, with the virtual coin. And the coin just basically did that. So very, uh, very, very, very impressive. Um, that, that was, uh, yeah. We win $10,000. True. Um, yeah. I think this is what I was trying to do. So yeah, very nice. Yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. All right, you guys. Anyway, I hope you, at, at least some reward. Well, this is the first time we did this. I want to definitely do more of this for sure. Um, but this is the first time we did this. So I think next time what I'll do, because we're definitely going to do this again, is I, I'll, I'll probably give some subs or we'll, we'll come we'll come with some actual rewards um, for the next time. But I just want to do this and get make sure it works. Also, to be fair, with a bot, we'd never tested it. So like with the bot, I was actually worried the bot would break because we tested it with like five or ten games.